it's the king king j back with another video today we're going to talk about kuma and panda bears is what the pro players entitle them right now i am looking forward to this one because i got some notes from aram that I, he said to me yeah let's just check this out aram is like one of the stronger players with bears so yeah i want to see what's going on so let's get into it i've got some notes on my own as well so yeah don't mind me because i know that there's some stuff with this character that's really really good so yeah let's get into it all right so first things first key moves uh two one it's pretty good two's a good move as well two two one down forward four down back three full crouch down one um up one plus two but you can do up one plus two down so if you do up one plus two by itself it's minus four if you do it press down minus three also as well you could go manually into hunting stance with hunting stance you get three plus four which is a power crush you get down forward two which is your tornado move you get uh one plus two which is also a tornado move and then four one plus two which is an unbreakable grab the only way you can break it is by crouching so those are the stuff that are in hunting stance go back forward two which is a counter hit launcher. So if I do if I do it normal. So I didn't change it off. There we go. So you do counter hit. So you, yeah, you get a combo. And then you got running one plus two. Which is a very annoying move. And then you got hunting uh where was it? Hunting. Where are we looking at here? So you got one plus running one plus two and hunting down one plus two. There we go. And then one two. And counter hit. Nice damage. And then you got down back four. But you need to have counter hit though, that's the thing. And then on top of that, you have up forward three, which is your hop kick. You can do up forward three, four, one plus two. But if you do up forward three, four, one plus two, hold on, down, the frames go different. Then we have one plus two in, in, hunt, in hunting stance which gives you a nice juicy combo then you have side step one plus two which is a bit weird right because sometimes it will do this right it has to be at a certain angle see <laughs> it's weird like it doesn't hit every time which i find very very strange so yeah and then there's also a couple things as well that kuma has some charge moves so i've got some notes here down one two down back one two charge move and it does loads of chip damage uh down back down back two plus three and then you have while standing one two then you have hunting stance which is oh sorry hunting stance which is one two but you could charge the last you could charge the two right so I thought I'll just add that stuff. He also has a 15 frame G cliff. So that is one, that forward one, two, one plus two, which is only minus 14 on block. And then you have down two, one, that forward two, one, which is his launcher. 50 frame launcher. Into combo. And then he also has, I would say down, down back two is a good key move. Very annoying. And has range as well. You could mix up with up while standing four. So there's that. I think that is it for all the stuff. Down back one plus two, one plus two, one is a wall combo. And then obviously the G cliff, which is one, one, one. This I think this is a very strong key move that you need. Like, but this is more on the you're trying to counter hit someone that's how g cliffs work if the first hit hits and a counter hit then the rest is guaranteed so yeah i think that is it in terms of 
when the characters are in heat let me show you let me show you let me show you players heat so uh charge moves come out faster look how fast that one came out so yeah but the frame advantage does not change on both hit and block but roll has a hitbox which is a special mid forces the opponent forces the opponent guaranteed mix up on hit on block in heat roll one which is a high attack becomes a guard break which leaves you at plus 13 when roll one during heat gets blocked let's have a look at that so roll one will be down one plus two one so it's plus 13 which is crazy so with this it says however with kuma you want max damage so you would go for the heat smash after the guard break So you could probably do uh, 4 2 one right? But then you'd probably, yeah, it's true. 21, 35, yeah, 35 does more damage. I think I would like to stay in heat though. But then, yeah, no, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right. And then afterwards you have... On heat, you have down 4-2 which is down for three uh two plus three which is kuma's electric so yeah you got that but you can charge this so yeah which is pretty cool, and it doesn't take that much from the it doesn't take that much from the heat bar to be fair. So, yeah, you would be using that. In terms of, I wasn't gonna go too much into punishment, but I will, and I will show you what Panda does at the end of the video in heat. So, for ten frame is two one, for twelve frame is four two one, for thirty frame is one plus two. Which is the demon paw? Was it demon breath? Demon paw? I don't know what the name. Yeah, I think it's demon breath. Sorry. So this is from Heiachi, and you also have uh, down back one two. Four two one is your best punisher from from I twelve to I fourteen frames. I think that's because of the knockdown as well. Fifty frame is that four two one or back four two? So that four two one is this. Or back forward to. So it's up to you. Then while standing punch is while standing four, while standing one, two, which is 13 frame. And then 50 frame is while standing two. So yeah. And then your combos, your combo filler for most most of Kuma stuff. Will be back two what two one right or you could do back two one press down and then down four two so that will go take you into hunting stance so let's do it again back two one down two f down four two so when i'm in the stance you just press down four two right now let me show you what panda does because panda in heat is completely different in terms of what stuff they what stuff she gets so with Panda, the Heat Smash, which can also be done in Hunting Best Starts, is 15 frames and does 44 damage and is plus 7 on block when you stay standing. Heat Smash into Hold Forward goes into Roll Mix Up after it's plus 6. Yeah, that's pretty crazy. So the Roll is... Let me see if I can press that Roll 1. Oh, okay, that's crazy. So I would stay down in that situation then. He smash into a, into a hunting stance and leaves you at plus 11 on, let me see. See, it leaves you plus 11 on block. Let's see. So this one's plus seven. Okay, so wait, what did he say here? 
Heat smash goes for uh for heat smash hold forward goes into a mix up at his plus six. Uh heat smash into uh, hunting leaves you at plus eleven on block. So what I'd have to do, press down. Oh there we go, that's crazy. And then up forward three plus four. Is Panda Shooting Star, which is a mid attack that knocks your opponent down and is plus 12. Leads you into a sit uh, sit stance mix up. However, if you hold forward after Shooting Star, will transition into a roll but can but can be interrupted or floated with an 18 frame or faster mid attack. Let me try. That's kind of crazy. So, yeah, that is bears like they're pretty pretty solid i think better than how they were beforehand let's take off the heat let me talk to you so no heat limit obviously this character is pretty 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 hard to kind of like i would say get great with because not many people play this character this character usually isn't that great but kuma and panda both have the headbutt i have rock and roll circles which is half circle back forward one plus two again you could learn to buff that in through moves in a guide that's coming out next week the full one plus two is and this is from hunting this is unbreak you cannot throw break this you have to duck this has been from the beginning of time with this video, uh, with this uh, throw. You have to duck. So yeah, that is it. Hope you lot enjoyed the guide. Remember to subscribe and leave a comment if you don't like stuff like this. And yeah, we'll be on today's video. Take it easy. Peace.